Okay. So I've been thinking for a little bit, and I'm not sure how to relate to you. I think the best way is to, of course, know that I, we're all connected on this plane. And that after a spiritual rebirth, in other words, death of physical possessions and attachment, and a rebirth on this earth, as it talks of in the Bible, we we become beyond time and space and and nothing gets between us. You and I are together. So we all know that we're working towards the same goal. And how do we coordinate this though? So that we can become just as effective as the media and all these manipulators have been in convincing people to use money in convincing people of our own agenda or our own uh, intention as in to, to barter or to exchange food and what have you and that's the crossroads I don't know what the appropriate course of action is I do know that this this concept of the independently sovereign being is rich and seems to go beyond even this or structure and create something more organic, more personal. The I am an independently sovereign being is powerful. It's, it's like, whoa, this is actually happening. We're all taking care of ourselves and we're doing it in a way that we make sure that we satisfy ourselves so we don't need to reach for sin and gluttony, lust and, and other forms of sin which separate us and make us fear each other. I mean it's not it's not like some war far away that we're worried about. It's like the arguments we're having with our family or or wife and the truth is is that perhaps these roles that people play like a like a husband and wife are not serving us anymore because time is fa moving faster the Schumann resonance the heartbeat of the earth it is increasing and we're about to experience a pole shift and we're lucky because this is a, a riff in space-time. It's a riff that that has happened every 26,000 years. And luckily, we get to experience this culmination of technology. I think technology is at its height. And I don't know how much farther it can go. Like right now, I'm using a great laptop. I don't know how more it can go. And I think that technology has gotten to the point where it lets us do a whole bunch of stuff in a short amount of time. So then we can have more options and more choice so we can ex exercise our free will and go out into nature now, you know, return back into the jungle. <laughs> These are thoughts and let's keep the train rolling, the train of thought. And remember that, hey, although time's speeding up and everything's moving, not to get seduced by it, because we're powerful. I am you. Let's maintain. Thank you. Aloha.